This contest is set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing first from the kingdom of Tonga, Lady Tapa. Taz Lady Tapa from the yeah. kingdom of Tonga, an athlete that you, I understand, are quite familiar with. Yes, I am. Uh, you know, I, I, uh, back in the day, a couple of years back, I've had the opportunity to call some of her matches. Yes, I'm familiar with Lady Tapa. So she is a uh, very intense, very focused, very tough athlete for sure. As for the, if you've never seen her, you will witness that in this matchup. Wow, staring daggers. And her opponent from Painesville, Ohio, Kylan King. Kylan King. You can see. Not an impressive record. It belies how skilled she is, Taz. No, she is. I mean, you know, we have several athletes here that we'll see uh, weekly on Dark that maybe don't have great records, but yet they have great outings, and they're all due. And I think Kylie King is due. She's she's always impressive, and she'll have no back down in Lady Tapo, who's making a debut here in AEW. As the as the old adage goes. Journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. That first victory inside an AEW ring can be the key to unlocking the kingdom, basically. There's about five cliches about kingdoms and dungeons and dragons and polyudric thighs. Dies. It's, Ky it's Kylan King. Okay, so that's, that's true. He's Good a point. puner, a play on words. <laughs> And King is physical here with that headlock tight on Lady Tapa. Tapa. Ooh, man. Whoa. Rough tackle since <laughs> Kylan King spilling to the outside. I'm not kidding. That was rough. Tapa taking her time. Oh, maybe a little too much time, Taz. Yeah, no, I think there was a little bit of a delay right there. But oh, oh wow. Full body attack. Trucking Kylan King right there. I'll tell you, from uh, when I... Uh, was calling her matches, you know, a few years back, Lady Tapa. She definitely seems to be a little leaner, a little more uh, stealth in, in, in different type of conditions, so it's impressive. Ky oh, Kylan King went for the clothesline on Tapa. Tapa, oh, 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 by the head. Oh, damn. She might have leaned out, but she is not lacking in the power department. No, no, no. She, is, she has got height on her, big, big hands, a lot of intensity, but King, again, both these ladies just tough as hell. Oh, Tapa stops King in her tracks with the boot to the midsection. Oh, Samoan drop. Well done. Covers one, Scott two, her. no. Kylan King able to break free. Oh, you see her eyes just yes. she snapped, dude. She's pissed. King, oh, breaks the grip off the hair. A series of elbow strikes. A little bit of a do -si do reversal situation. Oh, Lady Top is like, oh, all right, you can hit me like that. Oh, yeah. And King's like, I'll hit you again. Kylan King ducks under the clothesline attempt. Cross body. One. Ooh. It's not a power of Lady Top. She didn't even arch to kick out. She just used her arms and muscled King off of her. Yeah, that was all upper body there. Top and now, fireman's carry. Ooh. That, that was right on the button with that elbow by King to counter out. Kylan King. Slamming Tapa into the ropes, coming back on the clothesline. Tapa not expecting that one. She got rocked by Kylan King. Yeah, you can see it's tough for her to recover for Lady Tapa. She cannot recover after that. Now King not wasting time going to the top rope for something. King headed up top to the high rent district. Frog splash. Perfect. Covers one, two, three. Wow. Oh, nice. Now, uh, winner of this match, Kylan King. She did it, man. She got the Duke. She got the big win. Kylan King taking that all important first step here tonight on AEW Dark. Lady Topic, I don't want to do something about it, but then I think Kabani felt the effects of that frog splash. Speaking of frog splash, there it is. Picture perfect from Kylan King. Wow, really well done. What a match by these two ladies. That was, I, I love that, it was great. The King! It was a hard fought contest, but Kylan King perhaps finally realizing her potential here tonight.
Nice, here we go. Can't wait to see it. Whoa! Que Dios bendiga la botella. Oh my gosh, Chris! You've completely outdone yourself. But dead ass, yo, how is this even possible? I mean, look at the craftsmanship. It's so beautiful. Look how it turned out. It's absolutely exquisite. Drink what the demo god drinks. A little bit of the bubbly is back, baby. Supplies are limited. Go to littlebitofthebubbly.com and order now. Get it before it's gone, because last year sold out. Viva el vino brioso! Yeah!